The world chess champion Magnus Carlsen is one of those few people who was born with an incredible intellectual capacity. Due to his sharp mind, he's considered the fastest and finest chess player out there. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll tell you about the time when Magnus Carlsen checkmated his opponent in 9 seconds. Magnus Carlsen Fastest Checkmate Magnus Carlsen is truly a champion. If you have any doubts, then just look back at his 2013 World Championship, which is a testament to his greatness at chess. In 2013, he beat the unbeatable champion Vichy Anand and paved the way for his success. Ever since then, he's come to bag many prestigious titles for himself. In 2019, Carlsen came face to face with young Vidit Kudrathi. The game was the briefest match that Carlsen had played in his career. Carlsen started with e4, to which Vidit responded with e5. Then in a series of moves from nf3 to nc6 and bc4 to bc5, we saw a surprise move by Magnus, a d4, a pawn sacrifice line. Yep, that wasn't how Magnus often went with his moves. However, Vidit accepted the pawn exd4, and then Magnus moved his knight to g5. After doing so, the match was over because Magnus offered a draw. Vidit, though he was confused, politely smiled and accepted the draw. The reason why he offered the draw was that the Norwegian chess grandmaster was having some stomach issues, which left him unable to continue the game. Later, the sources revealed Magnus Carlsen, who was troubled by an upset stomach that saw him even take a five-move draw with Vidit Gudrathi at the start of the day and then raced away with the title following a record tally of 27 points. He improved his previous record of 26.5 points, set in the first event of the season. But that's not it. He actually checkmated one of the most famous personalities in just 12 seconds. Magnus Carlsen checkmates in 12 seconds. The one taking this bitter defeat was none other than the world's richest man at the time, Bill Gates. Yep, you heard us right. Bill Gates was beaten at chess by the Norwegian chess grandmaster, Magnus Carlsen. It took him a little more than a minute to beat Gates. The Microsoft founder actually has long possessed a passion for chess, so when he came face to face with the world's number one chess player during a Norwegian-Swedish television show, Skavlan, hosted by Norwegian presenter Fredrik Skavlan, he decided to try his hand. Various celebrities have appeared in the show. As per the sources, Carlsen had been a guest on the show more than once before. During the talk show, Carlsen only took 9 moves and 12 seconds on the clock to checkmate Bill Gates. Yep, even though the Microsoft founder started the match with great enthusiasm, Gates soon found himself losing the match, and the match didn't last very long. As per the sources, Carlsen was given 30 seconds on the clock, against 2 minutes for Gates. The American billionaire opened with 1e4, but didn't start the clock. Carlsen positioned his pieces, then started his own clock and played 1 in c6. It was soon over. The moment the match started, Magnus tried to win as soon as possible, and he proved his speed by succeeding. After the match, Gates even remarked, wow, that was fast. The reason why Carlsen was quick to win the game successfully was that he had actually calculated the idea of how Gates would proceed with his move during the game. As per the experts, the Norwegian player actually made moves that would be considered bad, but he used them as bait to lure Gates into a trap. Many experts agree that Gates' final move appeared amazing from many angles. They claim it appeared to force the win of a piece, which would give Gates an advantage. However, there was one problem with that. Its move allowed checkmate. Franklin Chen, who's a US Chess Federation master, points out that, have everything figured out but one detail and lose horribly. What are the analogies in life? There are many. In warfare, missing one vital piece of information could mean losing an entire battle. The Challenger Tragedy. Mission critical computer software. Professions such as surgery and race car driving hinge on detail. After this match, the Norwegian TV channel posted a detailed report on the show and the spectacular game between the two famous personalities. The report said Carlsen had to admit that he had to break one of his own principles, namely not to use cheap tricks to win. The world champion was obviously referring to move 7, in e5, which wasn't correct but did bring him a very quick checkmate. After beating the founder of Microsoft, the Norwegian chess grandmaster also talked about teaching Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg chess a week before. He said Zuckerberg was much better after an hour. He was then asked whether he's friends with Zuckerberg on Facebook, to which Carlsen replied, no, I do not accept everyone on Facebook. Yep, sometimes Magnus can be pretty savage too. Carlsen seemed like your typical celebrity, but there's a reason why he's different from the others. He became a grandmaster when he was just 13 and continued to work his way up his career. He became the world champion at the young age of 22. 
Apart from being a chess champion, he's also modeled with famous actress Liv Tyler or G-Star Raw. He also ventured into the world of business when he founded his first ever company called Play Magnus in 2013. And currently, he's the best chess champion in the entire world. This brings us to the end of the video. Thank you for watching.